Hi everyone, thank you for joining me once again here at Float Arts by Elsa. And today what we're gonna be working on is a 10 by 20 inch canvas. I will um, bring you quick down to the table, but before we do that, I wanna show you a piece that I worked on off camera. The painting has been dry, it's beautiful. Um, I am gonna go ahead and I just need to resin it to finish it off, but I wanted to show you. And this is a 12 by 12 inch canvas. And take a look at her, isn't she beautiful? Look at that shimmer from the paints. It's gorgeous, absolutely gorgeous. Tell me what you guys think. Do you like it? Do you like the colors? How about that base color? It's gorgeous. I wish I had a video for you, but I don't, I'm sorry. But I did wanna show you the painting. So there it is, beautiful. I may embellish the center with a saying or something. Um, leave the comments below, tell me what would you like me to, uh, to do to this piece? Do you want me to embellish it with a saying? Or I don't know, give me suggestions, what you wanna see. So this piece will be available for purchase um check out my website fluid arts by elsa you can also follow me on instagram or facebook under the same name fluid arts by elsa so let's put this away and we are gonna go right down to our canvas let's go ahead and get started okay so we're gonna go ahead and get started here i was painting sorry guys about the paint here on my table but today we are going to be using Primary Yellow by Amsterdam that I have mixed in this uh, container. It is mixed 75% uh, uh, white with the 25% of yellow to make it a pale yellow like this. The colors we are using, this is a weird combination, but I want to try it. We'll see what happens. We're starting with Pearl Olive Green by Arteza. And I'm going to do it here. Just like that. Okay. Next we have Payne's Gray by Creative Inspirations. Okay. And now I'm using Titanium Buff Light by Amsterdam. Now guys, I don't know how this is gonna turn out. We'll see. <laughs> May I? We might hate it or love it. I don't know. We'll find out together. Now I have Iridescent Blue Black by Peveo. I haven't used this color in a while and it's such a pretty color. A little dark right what do you think guys and now i have pearl chartreuse by arteza i like this color very similar to that base 
Okay, so I think I might add another color at the top. And the color will be Iridescent Green Blue by Pebble. So let's try this. Very pretty colors. Very pretty. Very rich. We'll see how that turns out. Let's pop those bubbles. Okay. And I'm going to use my small hair dryer. I'm going to do it on low. See how that turns out. I'm gonna work a little bit in here. So this is the first place where I want to kind of bring in more negative space. Just like that. Gorgeous. Okay. Excuse me. Gonna work in there. Okay. Use this stick just to bring in some of this paint in here.
good. Okay, so I think this looks beautiful. I'm not gonna do anything else to it. I'm gonna bring you guys down for a close up. Okay, everyone, so here she is. It's gorgeous, I love it. What do you guys think? Check out that yellow base. The blues on the top, you can see them right there. They're like blanketing and, and like a line type of ribbon pour. I love it. The blue mixed in with the yellow made some of that greenish tone that you're seeing. I love it. What do you guys think? Tell me, do you like it? What do you think? It's a little beautiful piece. I will finish it off with a top coat of resin. I'll show you once it dries. But I think this is a very cute piece. Um, don't forget to click on the subscription button if you like what you see. Fluid Arts by Elsa. Also, click on the, not the um, notification bell. That way you're notified anytime I have any new content. And that way you don't miss a video that I post. Thank you for joining me. Thank you for supporting me, for following me, guys. I appreciate each and every one of you. And in here, <laughs> if you look at it, it looks like a frog or something. Look at the eye right there. Can you see that? Like a frog coming out of there. That's so cool. But yeah. Thank you for watching. I'll catch you guys in the next video. Bye.